I'm Monica Sancio, the creator of Fiber Power. And in just a few minutes, I'm going to tell you all about it and why I am so passionate about this subject. First of all, I'm originally a biologist. I graduated with honors and I always honor my career no matter what's going on. In fact, because of what's going on, I decided to do more research into the biology of nutrition and how we can actually fend off any disease, any substance that's in the air, anything that's going on, we can actually fight back with our perfect immune system created by God. So because of this, I said, hey, let's do some research. What are we eating too much of and what are we eating too little of? And I discovered something very, very simple that you may be familiar with is that you don't need more protein. You're already eating too much protein for the most part. We need more fiber. And I'm gonna tell you all about fiber, the different types of fiber, which fiber is actually the best for our immunity. And yes, it all has to do with our gut health, our gut microbiome, which I love because it's like the gut flora and now it's called microbiome. And it's just so fascinating to know everything about it. It's like, really? So those bacteria outnumber our cells Let's say we have 30 trillion cells, human cells, and they outnumber us by at least 9 trillion. And I've been doing more research because there's more data and it's like 70, 80 trillion, 100 trillion of bacteria, really, that are actually responsible for so much, for everything that goes on in our metabolism. And I'm going to focus on our immunity because that's what we have to strengthen, okay? We need to be stronger and more resilient with our own defenses, okay? We have the capacity to fight back anything. And I'm gonna make it simple, not technical terms. The most complicated word you're gonna hear is microbiome. And if I try to pronounce some of the bacteria, because you know, lactobacillus is what we know as probiotic, right? But there's hundreds of different species, even of that specific family. So you can imagine how complicated this can get, but we don't wanna, we don't need to get into the complex. Of course, I have to dive in and dive through it in order to sift the material that's actually practical because I'm all about practical nutrition. And I'm gonna be practical right now and just sit at my desk and keep on talking to you because it's so important that we realize we need more fiber. So how much fiber are we eating? For the most part in the US, 15 grams in average. And guess what we need? At least 30 grams a day. So there's a huge deficit there. In fact, us vegans, you don't have to go all vegan, but definitely fiber comes from plants. There's no doubt about it. It's just a fact. So whatever you do, include more plants. Whatever else you eat, include more plants. And I'm going to give you all the specifics in the next videos. But what I want to tell you is that I'm always going to go towards what is practical. I love theory and I love you know, doing hypothesis work and doing analysis, you know, analyzing this. I'm a Virgo, so you can imagine. I love to do more research. It's like, really, let's analyze this and let's analyze that. And what if we made it simple so that people could just increase the amount of fiber, the variety of fiber, and therefore the great good bacteria like lab, which is lactic acid bacteria that lives in your gut and is happy to live in your gut. In fact, we have bad bacteria too. We have pathogens just like outside as inside, but the idea is always to have a great balance and harmony of our best beneficial bacteria like lab. And that can only be achieved if we're feeding it right. And so when I promise people, hey, with fiber power, you can actually change your your, your life, you can change your mood and definitely your health and your immunity in three days or less. I'm not kidding because with every bite of food, we are already changing whatever's there, okay? We are altering it. We are either producing more of the good bacteria or of the bad bacteria. And I'm talking only bacteria, but yes, we could also tell, tell you about yeasts, about viruses and parasites and all the microbes that maybe you don't want to know about. But because of what's going on in the world, I'm telling you, do not listen to people who do not understand biology in the first place. Biology goes into microbiology, which is a specialization, as well as virology, immunology out of that microbiology. So, you know, you don't have to be a virologist. You don't have to be an immunologist, but definitely pay attention to this. Listen to me 
because I know what I'm talking about because of the research I've done. And also you have to be ethical, professionally speaking. And so I promise that I will have the highest integrity in this mini course so that you will get the best information and all the references so you could go into the more complicated material if you want. And if I made any mistake, you can even tell me. I'll have a feedback button so that you can also uh, make this better for everyone who's here because it doesn't matter your age, doesn't matter your sex, it doesn't matter your, your background, where you are in the world. The important thing is that you take care of your own body, your own immunity, you see? It's not about age, it's about how well we treat our bodies, for instance, okay? So this goes for anyone. And even though I specialize in helping entrepreneurs who work from home, like I do, okay, you can use my computer, uh, my phone, you know, it's like, okay, we have this lifestyle now, most of us. And it may be advantageous because now we can go to the kitchen more often and take care of our food prep so that it actually feeds the immunity that we naturally have so that we don't need any experimental injections. We don't need anything that's external. Just like we don't need anything external to make us happy because I am a life coach and I'm a happiness life coach at that. We don't need anything external to tell us that we are worthy, that we are great, that we are doing our best, which is what I'm doing right now. You know, it's like, it's all inside of you and you can do this. And I trust you. And I trust you so much that I know that if in just a few hours, you can change your immunity by eating, for instance, more oatmeal, more apples, because I kind of don't like the videos in which they're like hanging on and then you watch a whole hour video and they never gave you an answer. I'm going to give you solutions in all these nine minute videos that I'm making for this. I hope that I keep the time because I usually like to go over. But yes, I want to give you this overview and I'm so excited to know and also remember my biology because I started by my thesis. I started in nutrition. I was always interested in nutrition and always will be. And yes, I made a lot of mistakes along the way, like just following some of the books and some of the authorities in quotes and telling people to eat things that I would never ever tell you to eat anymore. Okay, because I was following the path of the status quo. Now I'm like, hey, let's think about it. In fact, don't believe anything that you see here. You've got a question. You've got to do your own research. You've got to feel your body. Listen to your own body and you'll know what is good for you. You see, because the way I eat is not the typical way anybody eats, anybody that I know actually, but the way I feel is not typical either. So if you want to be really great and your greatest potential if you want to be your best no matter what you've got to listen and follow fiber power oh my god i can't believe i got so passionate time is almost gone but yes fiber power is the way to your highest natural immunity and i'm going to teach you all about fiber in the next video thank you